Good afternoon, respected panelists, dignitaries, and my dear friends. I am Suresh Ayyade, Superintendent, District Bombay Hospital, Kandu. My topic is titled as Development of Homeopathic Genus Epidemics for Secondary Level Prevention of Dengue Virus Infection at Kandu District, Kerala. Introduction. Dengue fever is the most rapidly spreading mosquito-borne viral disease in the world occurring 50 million cases per year. It is re-emerging as a major scourge in Southeast Asian countries, affecting about 50 to 100 million people, causing 25,000 deaths annually. For the last 10 years, the number of dengue cases gradually increased in India. The state of Kerala is hyper endemic for dengue and is one of the leading states in the reporting of death due to dengue. Objectives. The current study was done to develop a homeopathic working case definition for dengue virus infection at Kandu district to develop a genus epidemic for secondary level prevention of dengue virus infection at Kandu district. Definition of key types. Homeopathic working case definition. The homeopathic working case definition is defined as a set of symptoms identified with a population of interest which characterizes the entire group with the location, sensation, modalities, concomitants and other features of a health related event and is constructed primarily for the development of genus epidemicus. Genus epidemicus. The genus epidemicus is operationally defined as a homeopathic medicine developed after repertorization of the homeopathy working case definition constructed from a defined population of secondary level prevention of communicable disease. Methods Design Exploratory design, both qualitative and quantitative, samples, participants reacting to dengue NS1 AD, sampling procedure, purposive sampling, population size 105, sample size 70, tools, reach case taking form, DF criteria, pain visual analog scale, Malayalam, temperature chart, statistical test, descriptive statistics, independent samples, man bitney, independent samples, rascal values. The sample size and sampling procedure. Total population size is 105 and sample size is 51. Case interviewed 78 and screening done for NS1 either reactive and cases excluded. 8 cases NS1 either non-reactive and final sample size is 70. Inclusion criteria. NS1 either reactive, all ages, both sexes. Exclusion criteria. IgG and IgM positive cases. Severe systemic illness psychiatric patients, comatous patients. And this diagram shows the 15 gram panthers where the study has conducted in Kandu district. <coughs> Tools for the data collection, pain visual analog scale and dengue fever diagnostic criteria for confirmed cases according to National Vector Bound Disease Control Program 2008. The fever grading, a level and grade, less than 100 degree Fahrenheit absent, 100.1 to 101 degree Fahrenheit grade 1, 101.1 to 102 degree Fahrenheit grade 2, 102.1 to 103 degree Fahrenheit grade 3, and more than 103.1 uh, grade 4. Thrombocytopenia grading, likewise symptoms are grading 1 to 4. Results, distribution of samples, sex, age and growth patterns. There is a difference in distribution. According to sex, male 26 frequency and 37.1 percentage and female 44, 62.9 percent. So, more uh, sample in samples, more are uh, present by female, uh, females and age 90 years and below 10, 32, 40 years, 22 cases, 41 to 60 years, 32 cases and 61 and above 6 cases. Block punches. Distribution, 5 no, 11 cases, both of them by 18 cases, irritate 22 cases and others 19 cases. Block panjaya and symptoms, independent samples, Ruskin virus test. Three symptoms are compared, fever, headache and myalgia. Fever result 0 0.029, headache result 0 0.000, myalgia 0 0.014. Sex symptoms, independent samples, man with the U test. Symptoms anorexia and nausea. Anorexia result 0 0.14 and nausea 0 0.039. 
homeopathic Rogers definition. Exploring symptoms, qualitative, interview and arrange case, case records, content analysis, frequency and intensity of symptoms, quantitative, that is PVS and DFDC. Selection of symptoms at or above 20 frequency, finalization of homeopathic working case definition with location, sensation and concomitants and modalities. Although that 24 symptoms were analyzed, identified in Kano district, and out of that only 15 symptoms were selected for working case definition, and the symptoms which represent 20 frequency and above only selected. Line graph symptom frequency and symptom grade intensity. So the all the symptoms are calculated for the main symptom grade intensity and main symptom frequency. And symptom grade intensity is plotted on the uh, x-axis and symptom frequency means symptom frequency is plotted on the y-axis. What are the 15 symptoms uh, with its characteristics? One fever and its characteristics. It's a duration, type of fever, concomitants, modalities. Headache and its characteristics. Myalgia. Arthralgia and its characteristics, diarrhea and its characteristics, tiredness and its characteristics, vomiting and its characteristics, nausea, chilliness and its characteristics, rashes and its characteristics, reduced appetite, sleeplessness, bitter taste, thrombocytopenia, erectile pain. These are the 15 symptoms selected for the working case definition. Development of genus epidemic is Hatch's mother. Flowchart, repertorization of homeopathic working as definition with without cost expert system, application of mirror Z principle, finalization of genus epidemics. These are the 15 symptoms used for the repertorization. Finding symptoms in the quadrants. So here the whole, uh, the whole graph is uh, uh, divided into four quadrants, quadrant 1, quadrant 2, quadrant 3 and quadrant 4. This is used uh, for to give more importance to the more important symptoms. So importance is given to the Q3, uh, Q3 quadrant that is high frequency and high intensity then comes Q2 quadrant high frequency and low intensity. Uh, applying mirror is a principle. So here the more importance is given to the symptoms present in the quadrant 3. And next quadrant 2 and if there is tie or equal marks then consider quadrant 4. So symptoms with the marks, uh, marks in Q3 and Q2 that is uh, there are two medicines which, which is emerged as arsenic and arnica with equal marks that is 12 marks. So then we consider Q4 and while considering the mark, total marks in Q4 uh, arsenic stand with 21 marks and Arnica stand with 19 marks. So arsenic mark with the 21 marks declared as the genus epidemicus. Discussion. Participants from 15 gram panchayats uh, studied under 4 block panchayats. 105 participants were reported as having NS1 AD reactive during the study time. 70 cases studied and 24 symptoms identified. Homeopathic working case definition for the current epidemic convert district was identified as 15 symptoms at or above 20 percentage. Frequency, working case definition for Payanur, Kothwarba and Irriti were different. Anorexia and nausea are different among males and females. There were five, that is 1.15% cases reported without fever. Findings, homeopathic working case definition for dengue virus infection at Kano district is identified. Presence of symptoms such as fever, myalgia, headache were different among participants of Payanur, Kothwarba and Irriti block panchayats. Anorexia and nausea were more among females than males in the given sample. Dengue virus infection can be presented without fever. Arsenicum alma was identified as genus epidemicus for dengue virus infection at Kano district. Limitations. The exact population size was not available. Cases reported at private hospitals and Irish institutions were unavailable. Case records shall be updated with subjective intensity of symptoms. Scope for further research. Extensive study using Qualitative uh, method is recommended. Study using more hematological markers are recommended. This is a headline of uh, which appeared in the uh, Daily Times of India on September 23rd. Dengue fever can be without fever. That was a report of single case which was identified in Delhi, Old India Institute of Medical Science by the doctors of AIMS. 
and uh, the patient was an inmate or the uh, an employee of that hospital. Remarks, uh, sorry, references and acknowledgments. Thank you.